Hi, I'm Marie Timms from Galen Catholic College in Wangaratta, Victoria, and I'd like to chat to you about the B4 computing kits that we're using. So 2020, we started using them as part of our integrated studies unit and we came across them in 2019 when we were researching and gathering ideas. So we have four threads and this is the STEM thread and B4 computing sits nicely in that. So our year sevens will do VEX Robotics, B4, and then a drones course in year nine. Each term they rotate around. So we'll get all the year eights throughout the year and um, a different cohort each term. When we first got the kits, we were a little bit worried about how strong and sturdy they would be, considering they've got little wires and connections and everything, but they have held up a treat, um, especially knowing that year eights aren't the most gentlest people in the world. So absolutely love the, love the sturdiness of them. You get um, workbooks and you can download them off the website and you can get the hard copies, but... Um, they give really simple instructions. It's really straightforward. Um, it's got all the activities, it's got solutions, um, everything that a teacher needs and a student needs. We've had a lot of engagement with our students. At the end of each unit, we get them to video themselves and explain what they've learnt. And this is just a couple of our students who have chosen one of the videos here. For you. Scan your two, your three, so back to three bits. Two plus one, yep. three. All the way up. You go all the way to 15. Go to 15 floor. When you get to 15, all the bits should be highlighted. And then when you press again, go all the way down to the bottom. So the because this is like a long term memory. So we change these. So if we go like up like this, it goes to one. So it resets that. So let's see how it sets one. If we go to two, we hit right, I'll change to two. Yep. So if we reset them all, and then go for that, you know, yeah. one, so we change to two, so it's <coughs> long-term yeah. memory, so we can always change these or, or whatever we want to do with them. So you can see how they were really engaged, and the engagement has been incredible. Um, it really has blown us away. Even our lowest level students who really struggle with maths, um, the idea that it's lights on, lights off for the various binary numbers for the ones and zeros. And so we've had those kids adding and subtracting in binary. Um, and as I said, they're kids who are struggling in maths. And then we've had others that have just flown through the course and really just sucked up all the knowledge. Um, we've added a few activities like this one with a binary um, key ring. And that's been really good to just break it up a little bit. but. Um, Ab absolutely fabulous engagement and then coronavirus hit COVID-19 so obviously remote learning that threw us into a bit of a spin but um, within a few minutes of sending off this email Carsten replied to say they've created an online version of the course well we were totally gobsmacked that there was an online version and it, the transition was as smooth as it could be. Um, really love the online version, love the kits, love the online version. It's it's so good. Um, as I said, it's it, this transition from one to the other um, has been a dream. Uh, every once again, it matches so nicely with the kits. Uh, so whether you've got the kits or you haven't got the kits, anyone is great. Um, so in summary, the engagement and it's got all abilities, the algorithmic thinking that we saw was great, the robustness of the kits, the online version is just as good and obviously loads of support from Carsten. He just answers your emails just like that, so really good. So everything you need is at the Digital Technologies Institute and obviously you can email Carsten or you can email me. Carsten's obviously the guru, um, but I'm happy to answer questions as someone on the ground who um, works with the students and the engagement of them is incredible. So, yeah, so I'll be about and hopefully I'll see you at the conference. Cheers.